poke fun at someone. Look D.E. Scott, it's not a similar Akram video. Look D.E. Scott, it's not a similar Akram video. Look D.E. Scott, it's not a similar Akram video. I've been taking time to work on me. Good for you, kangaroo application. I think that's what I should call that lich from now on. Kangaroo application. Um. Oh, that's right. My other one is much higher up. Uh, yes, my coronavirus is much higher up than my re reaping critic grasm. Oh yeah, that's nice. Look at that. Weapon elemental effects on the blade. Very nice, I guess. Um, I'm gonna roll with this. Okay. Now. 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 Now, to show off what did the coronavirus can do in the Warframe. My joke's all built. Colloquially known by the mass idiots of America as a memeza. Your job is to distract yeah. the enemy but that's while a the operative raids the shack for much needed supplies. Make your presence known. I can fly, mommy! They have That's just nice, shut down all systems. Very proud of you. Sending life support capsules your way. Wait, what? It's further below me. You know, Cephalon uh, just in your face. Ass hat Tenno, he, he's got a point. Why would I take something that can destroy, melt, level uh, 100 plus? Okay, I'm paraphrasing what he said in one of his videos. Yeah, why would I take something that can do much more damage output and go into a lower level area? <laughs> Also, damn. S curve, it, it, it's not doing shit right now. Despoiled Shield of Shadows, uh, Equilibrium, and what's that other one? Uh, quick Thinking. Yeah, I've got those on for longevity. Let's walk up. Tap, he's dead. Tap, he, they're, both of those are dead. Tap, he's dead. Tap, that guy's dead. This guy's dead. 7,135 uh, fucking radiation damage proc on him. Cap, they're dead. I resummon my idiots so that they can shield me in shadows. Tap, he's dead.
Yeah, um, uh, only problem is my frame is squishy. And how squishy it is right now is far less squishy than it was immediately after update 27.2. But hey, it, at least for the fuck's sake of Scott, it, he, you know, this this isn't a simulacrum video. At least it's not a simulacrum video. Because that's such a priority. It, it's, it's utter and complete paramount. That the most important thing is that this is not a simulacrum video. Thanks, Scott. Am I gonna do this for three fucking hours? My gas hat tenno? No, absolutely fucking not. I might do this until uh, Corrupted Boar shows up. Kick his fucking ass. Take the uh, mod that he drops, because that's pretty much it at that point, and then I'll fuck right off from this mission. Uh, I won't stay in it past that at all. Why? Because enemy scaling is still logarithmic, exponential. And player scaling is still linear. Anyone's gonna prove me wrong. I, I would prefer it to be a YouTuber by the, the YouTube name of better name than me. Oh, look at that. It, it cancelled my desecrate. Took me all the way down to 30, 20 some odd health. Even with Necros's passive that gives uh, health regen for enemies that die near it. Combined with uh, Despoiled Desecrate and Equilibrium. Now, which, uh, well, let me just get rid of some energy. Yeah, maybe, maybe that's one of my biggest problems as far as survivability goes. I mean, because they buffed the armor that Necros has. They did. In the patch notes, uh, the update notes. But at least this is a simulacrum video. Get some excess energy. Bash living fuck out of some things. Get my shield of shadows back. Terrify some things, and then I'm gonna go and camp near the exit. Okay, D, there, there's several, several things. If you want more diversified builds, if, if you want people to play other frames, you let them have the power to do so. You don't constrain them. Because, uh, you know, look at it this way. You know, there was a parable, if you're Christianly inclined, about a king who tried to murder the ocean, and the more he squeezed, uh, the more the water went right through his fingers. Critical 
life support levels. Extraction is your best option. So the more you squeeze the player, the, the more they're just going to slip right out of the game. Running out of time, consider extraction. Let's see if I can get to one of these in time. So I would like to get corrupted four to come in so I can kill him. Him and his anus key. <laughs> Corrupted Vor's magical anus key and E. Steve's magical crotch. Those are two mods that need to go together. Let me tell you about that. And yeah, that is purely a pure owl. Toilet humor. Gutter ball. However, <laughs> yeah, at least this isn't singular. Tano, extraction is ready. One tap in. No longer alive. Uh, isn't Deathstrike supposed to make more? Um, fuck. Let's do this. Don't fucking. Fucking nelly bitch. Just found. Anyway, they could isn't not this supposed to make more of the uh, life support thingies drop out of the enemies? I'm just going to play hacky sack with these assholes. No, I'm not. I'm going to get deaded. What deaded me? Oh, it's one of these assholes. Yeah, anyway, yeah, um... The enemies are way too fucking powerful for this one. And, the, you know, grabbing a Necros is like the only way to efficiently do a survival. Isn't it? As far as uh, keeping life support uh, modules dropping out of the enemies to use, I am not going to get corrupted for out of this. No, no. Critical life support levels. The S curve just doesn't. It doesn't mean shit. It really doesn't. But at least it's not a simulacrum video. Yeah, the more you squeeze, D.E., the more you squeeze, need I say more? So, it's this type of asinine, satirical, sarcastic type of thing that you're getting out of me right now, that this is what the fuck you get from me when you go off and, and you just keep hammering that nail into the coffin. Because I want to prove a point. Now what frame is going to last long enough in there? 
because um, fuck me that used to be doable up to like 20 minutes for me that used to be doable at 20 minutes solo before the update now the S curve just apparently is a fucking buff to the enemies at, at that particular level like I said it needs to be linear not exponential which is interchangeable with logarithmic exponential is interchangeable with logarithmic it's mathematic it's different from linear I'm gonna just roll in with all my children big muscle shield mama yeah why not actually hold on Uh, yeah, there I go. Strength, uh, duration, and efficiency. So, that damage a second. <laughs> Haven. That is, that's some mean damage output, but it's only in five meters out. I tanked range to get it like that. Let's see if this is any different. This haven's gonna both help me, my frame, and do damage to the enemies. Distract the enemy while a fellow Tenno operative raids the ship for much needed supplies. Make your presence known. And you know, like uh, Asset Tenno pointed out, don't don't solution they settlement. Just, found just all systems. I'm sending life support capsules. Yeah, if you're going for the mobile market bullshit, well, Torf Yomstrom, just just fucking don't. You'll, you'll lose every last single fucking player you got. Really, because mobile gamers are gonna be like, "The fuck is this? This isn't a mobile game." They're gonna be like, "I don't have time for this shit. I want something where I just sit on my phone and press a button. That's your mobile gamer market." Ah, no, no, no! This totally isn't viable. Hey, I split him in half. Look at all the guts. Beautiful. Why? Why is the children's uh, shield strength based on strength, like ability strength? Just, just curious as to why the thing that uh, her abilities are based off of isn't based off of ability strength itself so that it makes her more survivable more tanky because that's essentially what Hildren is made as a shield tank This totally isn't viable. Not in the least. Yeah, maybe if I come back with my uh, fucking 5,000 uh, shield build, maybe that'll work.
anyway, this at least this isn't a simulacrum video. definitely needs a uh, attack speed mod put into it so it, it would really really benefit to have some more slots for the mod cards to go into This train is so damn fast. Oh, look! It's Captain Vor, the halfling! Fuck yeah! Listen, corrupted halfling Vor. I don't give a shit about your anus key, okay? It's your butt plug. I don't want to touch it, okay? And seeing as how it, it, it didn't bring back your lower half, it, it seems like a butt plug that you know, I really shouldn't want. Oh, look! Halfling four went down to my fucking joke saw. Oh shit, I'm about to go down to some random bitch. The Tenno are lost, and they will resist. But I, War, will cleanse this place of their impurity. Anyway, this is not good. No, not, not at all. I, I, what the hell? I lost all my shields instantly. Well, I am not staying any longer. Now, this is less viable than with my Necros Prime. This particular build. Missed it. Okay, right there. There I go. Halfling corrupt war used to be a problem for me. Used to be. But with the coronavirus, he's less than half a thing of what he used to be. And I say thing because he's definitely not a man. He may be chromosomally male, but he ain't got a lower half of which to speak. But hey, at least this isn't a simulacrum video. Alright, now it is time for me to test um, my 5,000 shield, which, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's not going to last fuck all either. Uh, fucking. Mm, no. Absolutely not. <laughs> Fuck no. Alright, alright. Everything's back to equalized at 100, basically. Except for that duration of 124. 
And shield is at uh, 5,265. Armor is at 765. <coughs> Health is up to 375. Maybe that. And you know, if, if I could combine my configuration A and B builds so that I had both the... the armor, health, and shield, and the duration, efficiency, and strength. Yeah, both of those together. I'd totally fucking do it. And I'd be able to last a lot longer solo. And uh, I, I don't know how the, um, the community, the player base is on PC, but... Here on Sexbox Live, it's fucking abysmal. Generally, I stay the fuck away from other players on Xbox Live. Period. No matter what game it is. The only reason I did that stint in uh, fucking COD Modern Warfare is to shut one asshole up. Because he wouldn't stop stroking his fucking dick about the goddamn game. You ain't stroking your psychological boner no more, are you, buddy? Your job is to distract the they done enemy. went and added Fellow fucking Kano Fortnite mode to the, the game. You yeah, shit. Make presence known. <laughs> They have just shut down all systems. I'm sending life support capsules your way. Alrighty, five tires and shield. And uh, a much more armor. You know, if this is more viable than both my Necros, which is, you know, exclusively fucking meant for survival, I may have to change that despoil augment, just to make Equilibrium more viable. I'll test that next. But if this, uh, 5,000 fucking shield is more viable than, uh, my hypothesized modification of my Necros Prime. I'll just fucking roll with it. Aw, hey carrier! You shoot things now! Fucking awesome! No, I'm not giving credit to Dee for that. Why the fuck should I give credit to Dee for doing things that they're supposed to fucking do? Come on, pillage! Pillage! Be a pirate! Shield mama, be a fucking space pirate! Absolutely fucking no, you bitch! Get the fuck right off! Okay, come over here. Let me shields come back up. Okay. 
Efficient levels. And don't feel my uh, weapon equipped arcane is working. Just, it, I feel like it's working. But right there, I saw that it's actually working. There used to be a visual cue uh, and effect. Come to scavenge and desecrate this sacred love. Critical life support levels. Extraction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Option. Shut up, space mom. Shield mama's on the case. But they are mere trespassers. Only I know the true power of the void. Or I don't believe you. Nefanyo would heavily disagree with me. Why are you inside of a wall? You riddle me that, Batman. Okay, stop this right there. It's not cool. Stop talking about your butt plug, Vor. You know, go play with Vayhek, okay? It brought me here, and here I was reborn. Behold, they cut me down. But still I speak. I am energy, and I cannot be destroyed. Ooh, toxic barrage. Corrupted Lancer. Did I get three of them? Really? Did I get three of them? That would be nice. But hey. At least this isn't a simulacrum video. Just why? Why, Scott? Why would you say such a thing? What? Why would you even talk? About 
Okay. Uh, Nigger's Prime. That's what I've always called him. Upgrade. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Okay. Consume health instead of energy, and health and energy interchange. Now what? Um, take despoil off, and got nine bits to work with there, so. Max energy. Armor, 125. That is just... Ha, 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 ha. Oh, that's laughable. I don't even have a B configuration, much less a C. Alrighty. Uh, Necros, take two. Every time, every time DE throws out an update, you know what everyone who, you know, has, has made a build and dealt with the updates changes has to do? All of us, we have to redefine our builds all over again. Keep the enemy busy. A fellow tunnel operative raids the ship for supplies. Well, you know, we shouldn't Ready? have to do that. Trigger the alarm. Life we shouldn't have to cut off. realign to choke you out. our builds. Hold on. Just I'm because sending auxiliary he life support. wants to push an update. That uh, is designed specifically to get more cash out of people. Okay, DE, seriously. If you want to get more cash out of people and you want more people in the game, just, just listen to me. Do what I tell you to do. Holy oh fuck. My shields don't mean shit in this place. Okay, I'm getting lots of health out of these assholes, but where's the energy? My attempt to make a viable build is falling apart. Okay, my shields are taking damage from being shot at. It's not being displaced onto my uh, minions here. Is that how Shield of Shadows is supposed to work? Because it says the damage is shunted from me to my minions. They take a certain percentage of the damage. Or is the enemy just doing so much damage that it's overwhelming them and spilling back over into my shield pool. Is that what's going on here? That's why we run these tests. 
that's that's what the simulacrum is for. But hey, at least this isn't a simulacrum video. Somehow, I get the feeling that this build is even less viable than with despoil. Totally less viable. I'm about to go down. I'm gonna despoil it. Desecrate is just not gonna work like this. This build just absolutely needs despoil. So I'm having to wait until I recharge energy. Let's go in, pop this, bring up some minions to absorb a little bit of damage off me. And the thing about this is these enemies are doing so much damage that even with Equilibrium on and the the despoil when I was in here previously, it, it just it, it's not it's just not. It's basically like saying, hey, you either get a fucking squad or you don't fucking play at all. Like I said previously, I don't know how the, the the player base community is on PC, but here on Sexbox Live, it's fucking shit. We absolutely need uh, solo play viability builds. Absolutely need. And you know, like I've said in. in couple of videos prior. Master rank 15. Give everyone four more mod slots across the board. For every frame, uh, arc wing, weapon, etc. that they've got. Shit, this build is shit. Look at them. They come to this place when they know they are not And this is a uh, 40 to 45, yeah, 42 right here. My brothers, and it's I just absolutely tearing me the fuck apart. When I used to be able to do this for an hour, and I can barely get to uh, fucking 10 minutes. Just barely get to it. Also, these arcanes need to rework. They need to be more powerful. Uh, the ones with range, AOE on them, they need to be 
far, far more expansive than their AOE props. Stop talking about your butt plug, Vor! Go play with Vahek. Go play with him on the plains of Dudulon. It's not planes, it's it's technically uh the tenor the mountain. And they will resist, but I hey, me. will cleanse this place of their impurity. Behold, they cut me down, but still Corrupted war and fucking Chancellor Vahek and just and I cannot be the fucking uh, butt plug fetish and the fucking ghoul fetish guy. And you know what? I think that both of their fetishes are completely interchangeable with each other. I mean, they are Grenier clones. Yeah, just to say. I've seen the Grenier sex dungeon. You know, who's to say? <laughs> No, seriously. Um, the, the the fucking S curve. It, it's not a it's not a buff to players. It is legitimately just a big fuck you. For for those who understand linear charts and logarithmic, or as a uh, uh, common terminology has it exponential charts exponential growth factors you know exponential logarithmic they're interchangeable they are not the same as linear which the enemies need to be the players aren't even linear most of the time okay flow that's just not doing shit despoil it's only minimally viable. This this whole build is only minimally viable. Said they gave everyone shield gating, but they gave it to the enemies as well. And then they buffed the enemy damage against shields. Yeah, I don't know what else to say. I really don't. Except, at least it's not a simulacrum video. Yeah, it drains energy to stop lethal damage with 240% efficiency. Quick thinking didn't do jack fuck all shit for me. And that that says something because before I put that on I was still dying a lot faster as Necros. Yeah, well, why did you shit on Necros, DE? Yeah, well, why? I I've changed uh, a few things around here from the the despoil to uh, make sure that equilibrium worked better so that uh, shit's jumping back and forth but it it didn't I figured hey if I'm using energy I'll just pick up all the orbs and it'll replenish my health no it didn't fucking work picking up all those health and energy orbs <clears throat> those drops need to scale with the enemy what they the rewards they drop they're their loot pool needs to scale with them, okay? DE? Yeah, that's another thing you need to change. Reward scaling. Yeah, that's something else Asshat Tenno was talking about. Because the, the fucking 25 points worth of health from those orbs that I was picking up didn't do jack fuck all shit. And... DE, when you do, do
do not nerf equilibrium. Do not nerf equilibrium. Do not nerf anything ever again. Stop nerfing things. Stop with the net nerf rationale. Stop nerfing. Is it, is it evidently clear that you just stop nerfing? Do I have anything that I can pick up? Yes, yes, I do. Clem. Um, oh, yeah, and these timers. I mean, we spend the time to collect the resources, and, you know, three day wait times for a frame. Just, if you want people to buy stuff in the game, here, let me show you what I'm talking about. And just bear with me. Bear with me. Let's see. I'm going to go to something. Uh... Okay. Some of these things. All right, like this 3000 ferrite for 30 platinum absolutely not if you want people to fucking buy things like this bump that number up to 30000 for 30 platinum fucking gallium one fucking gallium for 10 platinum? Are you out of your fucking mind? Bump that number up to 10 at minimum. Let's see, what's another one? Oxium. Extremely difficult to get. Only drops off of one fucking enemy type. And that includes its variation. It's corrupted, uh... And it's fucking um, infested variation. 300 Oxium? Yeah, I can get that in five minutes of one mission. For 30 Platinum? Yeah, you're fucking kidding me. Make the resources worth the purchase price. Yeah, bump this up to like fucking 30,000 for 30 Platinum. 1,000 per Platinum. Okay, DE, then this will be worth buying. Then I will fucking buy this shit. I legitimately fucking will. Let's see. The, I could go over, like... <laughs> what is this? Purchase for one fucking... One, one Tellurium for 10 Platinum. No. Make it 10. At least 10. For fuck's sake. You want people to spend money in the game? Makes this shit fucking show worth fucking spending Platinum on. Bump the living fuck up out of what you get for what you spend. And I remember when Oxium was 3,000 and it was 15 fucking platinum. Anyone else remember that? I remember that when it was that price on Xbox Live. Uh, let's see, what else? What else? Greater lenses. Hey, that price... I'm fine with that. Do not increase that price. But, uh... Th this is a decent example of something I find acceptable. The greater lenses for 40 platinum each, I find that acceptable. Maybe 
decrease it by five platinum. Maybe ten at most. That's that's a bit iffy. I'm fine with forty. Fucking Eidolon lenses. For how, uh, for how valuable these lenses are. 80? I'm fine with that. Definitely fucking fine with it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hold up. Yeah, how much is this? In, uh... 325 platinum. This isn't even a prime frame. And uh, then I'll see people selling primes. I've seen the Warframe market go as low as fucking like 75 or, or 100 platinum for a prime frame. The whole fucking thing. When the normal ones like this are selling for 325, how much is it? 375. Uh, someone said that uh, Wukong was fairly cheap. Key emphasis on was 275. Yeah. And th this isn't even prime. Yeah, but this price it isn't worth it. Cut these prices down. No regular frame should cost two seventy five or fucking three hundred and something. What's Wisp cost? Three twenty-five. No fucking way. When people are selling primes to each other for fucking seventy-five to a hundred each, and this shit is fucking two and three hundred. Just, just seriously, pricing. The reduce the prices on this shit. So in conclusion, update 27.2.2, net nerf, net nerf to all, <laughs> no fucking joke, I understand how log charts and linear charts work, I understand exponential growth curves, I understand regular linear growth curves, I understand the application of algorithms to a a system <clears throat> in the programming space of the game. I understand those basics. Those basic mechanics that are here. I understand, D and Microsoft, you both want to make fucking money here. But squeezing people, like Torolf Jönsson said, is not the fucking way. People are now waking up to this bullshit. And they are rebelling heavily against it. Sixteen years ago, Microsoft, I wrote letters to your fucking ass. I told you, I see a problem. I want to work with you to help fix this shit. You fucking ignored me. Ignore me now, and I will make sure there are heavy fucking consequences to pay. I promise you that. I swear to you that. I will make sure that there are severe and heavy consequences to pay for not listening to me and disobeying me now. You think uh, that I'm thinking I'm entitled? No, I've had over 15 years to think about the ramifications of what I'm talking about right now. I'm sick of this bullshit. It is far beyond time for it to stop. Over 15 years past time for it to stop. 
but hey, Scott, at least this isn't a simulacrum video. So like usual, till next time, fuck right off.